Mariam Benani is a Moroccan-born artist whose work explores the relationship between fiction and reality. From media she appropriates to images she shoots, Mariam always has her eye open for new material. I joined her on the hunt for inspiration in New York City. There's just always so many fun things happening. So should we film some people just to yeah, add some yeah. hats? Should we do you and Ella? So can one of you be a little bit behind the other one? Everything I do is about pleasure, and like I think pleasure is really important. It's like a very serious factory for something really fun. Maryam's after effects are always humorous and usually also subtly challenging. Like I see something and I just imagine how I can add one thing or remove one thing and how it's just gonna read completely differently. Everything that you watch after that, even if there's no effect, you, you expect that something might be fake and you start questioning reality too, you know? How would you describe the jokes you make in your work? They're a little bit silly, like they're a little bit childish. <laughs> but then I think that, like, paste it onto a context that is more, like, um, serious or, like, charged, then they can maybe get more interesting. Come here. Come here. Wow. <laughs> One of Maryam's creations is Fardawa's Funja, avant-garde hijab design. It just plays with the trope of like how like Western culture like imagines, you know, like Eastern culture, Middle Eastern culture as like completely isolated. And you know, that's not how anything is anymore. My main subject is not religion. I'm not interested in, in that. What I'm interested in is the social political aspect of the hijab and when it starts overlapping with fashion. So why not also like be playful with it? Like fashion can be playful. When you think about the current political climate and some of the things which Donald Trump has said about Muslims and bans on Muslims, do you feel a different kind of responsibility as an artist or does it not affect you? I don't have any agenda ever. We're all political, we all come from places and have like stories within us. And those influence your work at the end, whether you want it or not. I put a lot of faith in intuition because I think that in the place of intuition is embedded what you really care about.